Hey, I'm Tim Davis, DevOps Advocate with M0. Today, we're going to talk about governance and self-service inside the M0 platform. And we're going to do that using the M0 platform that we use to deploy the app. So as you can see here, we're in the M0 dev organization. This is going to be the actual production organization that we use. We've got three projects here, M0 front-end deploy dev, prod, and also our M0 lab. Let's take a look at the settings that we have here for governance. So with this, we can come through and we can add all the users that we want to with the organization. Inside the organization tab, they can either be a user or an admin. Users can be scoped down within the projects and admins cannot. So if we go over to one of our projects, let's take a look at the N0 front end deploy project. You can see we have two active environments that are running right now. And let's go ahead and take a look at our project settings. So inside of the settings, we have our users. And with this, we have several different roles that you can do. So let's say that Alex all of a sudden wants to start contributing, you know, and actually deploying environments and things like that. So let's see what kind of roles we can scope him to here. So we have viewer, planner, deployer, and admin. And this really goes along with the process steps for Terraform. So you can see we can actually set people up, we can make sure who's able to see the organization, who's able to participate in the projects, and what level of participation they're actually able to do. With Planner, you can go ahead and run the Terraform plan and it's good to go. It'll go ahead and wait for approval from somebody who is either a deployer or an admin. Um, or if you do have deployer, then you can go ahead and you're able to approve plans and run. And then of course, admins can go through and they can see the full scope of settings. They can manipulate users and things like that. If you have any other questions or anything like that, feel free to check us out at env0.com and follow us on Twitter at ENVZERO.